All right, I just want to take a quick little look at this. This is called the Spyderco Meerkat. And I want to do a little series on different locking mechanisms in folding knives. I'm going to start with this because this has something really unique. And it's not really unique, it's a twist on something pretty traditional. But it's called the Phantom Lock. And if you look it over, you can't really see any obvious locking mechanism release. Let me see that stainless steel backspacer. Let's open it up. And that backspacer there is actually, I don't know if you're going to be able to see it or not, it's actually two stainless steel liners with a lock bar in the middle. Now to release it, as seeing as there's no lock back, like there would be in a traditional lock back knife, you actually press down on this scale, pushing it down and away from the actual liner of the knife. I'm going to try to show you. Put your thumb right in this is the easiest way to do it. You'll be able to see the liner separate from the scale right here. Hopefully you can see that. Another place you can see it is up here. See the liner pivots off the scale, pivoting on this pin right here. And that releases the tension on the lock bar and lets the blade swing free. And again, it's kind of hard to show you that. Let's try this again. You can watch back here, you'll be able to see the liner underneath the scale there when I pull it up. It's just a really cool little take on a lock. Um, this knife is awesome as well. Tiny, not tiny, but it's very small, but for its size it's very ergonomic. You've got this notch here for your pinky which makes it really feel like a bigger knife in your hand. Um, VG10, typical Spyderco, extremely sharp, really high quality steel. <clears throat> I'm not really talking about the knife though so much as the lock. Although this is the only lock I've ever seen with this, or only knife I've ever seen with this lock, so it's very cool. AG Russell does something called a one hand or one sided lock. I don't remember. Kind of similar. But this is very unique. I just wanted to show it off a little bit. It's a great little knife. Kind of chunky for its size. It's so small, it seems like it doesn't need to be that thick. But it makes it a lot easier to hold on to, I think. And the, the blade angle in relation to the handle is also really well done. Very happy with it. And this is a burgundy sprint run. They came originally, I think, in black, and they did a light blue kind of sprint run. And this is the latest iteration. Really, really cool little knife. I just wanted to give you a, a look at that phantom lock. You, see, you can actually see, when you open the knife, you'll see, be able to see the scale disengage from the liner there. Hopefully you can see that right there. But it opens. And close it. And that's that. I'm going to try and do another lock sometime soon.